the joy of the journey of marriage is learning to love one another centered around God so that you can walk into the fullness of his purposes for your new life together. The two becoming one. I'll be forever by your side I'd swim across the ocean wide I'd climb the tallest mountain high Jeff is someone to me and I think to so many people who is just a solid foundation. He's a friend who is very centering. We were talking about a lot about what we consider the default. He was just so excited, Natalie, to be like, Zach, my default, I get to go home to Natalie. Just that, that, that an unconditional love and that excitement, that joy of just going home to someone and just knowing that that's your person. This man loves you so much. In the name of God, I, Jeff, take you, Natalie, to be my wife, knowing in my heart that you will be my constant friend, my faithful partner in life, and my one true love. I promise to always love you and to always be your friend. Today, I reaffirm my choice to love you and promise to continue to choose you every day hereafter. I promise to love you without reservation, comfort you in times of distress, encourage you to achieve your creative purpose, laugh with you and cry with you, grow with you in mind and spirit, always be open and honest with you, and cherish you for as long as we both shall live. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Jeff Haas, you may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, I have the distinct privilege of introducing to you, for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Jeff and Natalie Haas. You are God sent. You are a soul sister to me. I love you more than words can express, and I'm so proud of you. Jeff, this weekend has just continued to solidify how perfect you and Natalie are for one another. You are loving, kind, funny, thoughtful, up for anything. But more than any of that, you love Natalie so well, and you make her happier than anyone else can. The best is yet to come, and I am so excited for you both. I've always said that a man should have a daughter. It is eye-opening, the world that they live in. It changed my life. You have been a blessing since the day you were born. As the father of the bride, friends of mine were asking me, you know, how do you feel coming up to the wedding? And I said, you know, guys, it's pretty easy when, you, when you're actually, you love the kid she's marrying. This is not a giving away, like, you know, like they say, and it's not a losing, it's, it really is, it's a union of two families. 